guys, I just wanted to show you the new greenhouse that I got. So, yeah, let's get to it. <laughs> this is my new greenhouse. I've been wanting one for about three years now, and I'm just so happy to finally get one. It's a three by four meter greenhouse, um, and is by it's two meters high, so you can use it for growing vegetables, starting seeds, growing cacti, growing tropical plants, um, doing whatever you want basically with it. I'm using it as a seed starting um, greenhouse, and also growing new vegetables, and also for just keeping plants that. I can't keep outside during winter and I'll keep them inside here instead of keeping them inside the house. Um, I got this greenhouse from a website called Bell and Payton. They have been really, really well. It, when we ordered it, it took three days to for it to get here and it arrived in perfect condition and it was really easy to set up. It took us three hours to set up me and my dad and the nice thing about it is that it's portable so if you don't like it in a particular spot and you want to move it you can it's very lightweight so it won't be difficult because it's made out of an alum it's made the frame is made out of aluminium and um yeah so it was really easy to set up it comes with two doors over here that you can zip up and you can roll up so that you can use them as ventilation on a hot day and it also comes up it comes with eight ventilation holes over here that you can open and close as you please um as you please and it also has insect um netting on the one side so that insects can't come in or any birds or anything that might do damage to your plant and then you can close it at the end of the day um when you because uh, you want to retain any heat in greenhouse gets really really hot when we put it up i closed the door and i came back the next day at about two three o'clock and it was 40 degrees inside of here it was 18 degrees outside and it was 40 degrees inside so you can really tell how um how hot it actually gets inside the greenhouse the greenhouse isn't completely done yet I still need to dig it into the ground I still need to dig it into the ground and I need to put shelves up over here just to allow for more space to grow more vegetables in here I'm also going to put down some garden fabric um, on the ground just so that no um, weeds come up because I don't really want to weed in here you can also see that I did put some bubble wrap over the plastic and that is just to, to allow for um, insulation because it got to minus 8 degrees here. I didn't want all my vegetables and tropical plants and desert plants to die. Um, and I just didn't want them to die because I have quite a lot of seedlings here. I have 600 gooseberry plants that I can't really afford to actually lose because I am growing them for someone. Um, a farmer and um, so yeah that's just the new greenhouse and I just really love it and I'm so excited to actually start growing in here and just get everything done and just start to grow so many vegetables for my aquaponic system or for my vegetable garden or for different farmers around here or to sell to nurseries or to just have in the garden or yeah i'm just so excited so yeah i will keep you guys along every time i do something new in here i'll post a new video about it and yeah so i hope you guys enjoyed this video um please like share and subscribe and um i'll see you guys next time